Good morning, students. Today we are continuing the questions of exercise seven point four, question number seven and question number eight. That is, find the LCM by using common division method. First question is, that is question number seven, fifteen and twelve. We have to find the LCM of fifteen and twelve. By using common division method, okay. So let's start with the seventh question. That is fifteen and twelve. First step is to find their prime factors, okay. So here we are finding the LCM. So we are taking these two digits together, fifteen and twelve. Let's divide the numbers by their smallest prime factor. Fifteen smallest prime factor is three, but twelve smallest prime factor of twelve is two. So we have to go in ascending order. So let us take two. Fifteen as it is, we have to write because it cannot be divided by two. Okay. Now divide twelve by two. That is answer is six. Again we have to follow the same step. Two fifteen as it is because it cannot be divided by two. Six divided by two is three. Now the numbers are fifteen and three. Fifteen and three. Both cannot be divided by two, so let us move to next prime number after two is three. Okay, so divide this fifteen by three. Three fives are fifteen. Okay, now next three three ones are three. Now the number is five. Five itself is a prime number. It cannot be divided by any other number. So let us take five itself. Five ones are five. One as it is. Now we got the prime numbers here. Now the LCM equal to the prime numbers are two into two into three into five. Okay. Let us multiply. Two into two equal to four. Four into three into five. Now next, four into three equal to twelve. Twelve into five. Twelve into five equal to sixty. So this sixty is the LCM of fifteen and twelve. Okay, so what we have done, we just take an out the prime factors of each, that is fifteen and twelve. Now we got the prime numbers. Here we are multiplying the prime numbers two into two into three into five. Two into two equal to four. Four into three twelve, and twelve into five equal to sixty. So sixty is the LCM of this fifteen and twelve. Let us move forward to our next question. That is question number eight. Here three numbers are given. Okay, so we have to find the LCM of these three numbers. Okay, so question number eight is sixteen. Twenty-four and fifty-six. Now the numbers. Let us take the LCM. Sixteen, twenty-four, and fifty-six. Okay. First step is to divide them by using its lowest common factor. That is two. Sixteen divided by two. Answer is eight. Twenty-four divided by two. Answer is twelve. Fifty-six divided by two. Answer is twenty-eight. Again, follow the same step. Two fours are eight. Six is a 
are twelve and two ones are two, two fours are eight. Fourteen we are getting or dividing this twenty-eight by two. Again by two. Two twos are four. Two threes are six. Two sevens are fourteen. Okay. Now divide by two. Two ones are two. Three cannot be divided by two. Write that three as it is. Seven also as it is. Okay. Next prime number is three. One as it is. Three ones are three. Now seven cannot be divided by three. Write that seven as it is. Okay. Now seven. One. One as it is. Seven ones are seven. Okay. Now the LCM equal to. Here the prime numbers that we are getting are one, two, three, four. Four times two, then three, then seven. Okay. Then write LCM equal to two into two into two. Into two, into three, into seven. Okay. Now we have to multiply these prime numbers one by one. Let us multiply two into two equal to four. Four into two equal to eight. Eight into two equal to sixteen. Sixteen into three. Into seven. Okay. Now next, sixteen into three. Sixteen into three equal to forty-eight. Okay. Forty-eight into seven. Forty-eight into seven. Just multiply. This forty-eight by seven, we will get three hundred thirty-six. Now this three hundred thirty-six is the LCM of sixteen, twenty-four, and fifty-six. Okay, this question is lengthy. Because three numbers are given here, and we are getting more prime numbers. Okay, so here question is question number eight is sixteen, twenty-four, and fifty-six. We have to find the LCM of these three numbers. First, we just take a note the prime factors of each digit separately. Here, by putting commas in between. Then we got the prime numbers that are four times two, then three, and then seven. Now we just multiply them. Two into two equal to four. Four into two eight. Then eight into two equal to sixteen. Now sixteen into three into seven we are getting. Now sixteen into three equal to forty-eight. Forty-eight into seven equal to three hundred thirty-six. Three hundred thirty-six is the LCM of the sixteen, twenty-four, and fifty-six by using the common division method. Okay, so like this, we can find out the LCM by this method. Okay, thank you.